my name is Raul Raul Butler. I have just completed my undergraduate degree in biomedical sciences. I double majored in human genetics and molecular pathology. Uh, I completed my first two years of my degree at the University of Otago and the final two years of my degree at Victoria University of Wellington. Uh, both of these universities are located here in lovely, wonderful New Zealand, which is a place I've called home for the last nine years or so. Um, I also found out just 24 hours ago that my application to study medicine at the University of Otago was successful. So hopefully in 2026, I'll be able to graduate again, this time with a degree in Bachelor of Medicine and Bachelor of Surgery. My journey with Lysen began like most students at the nursery level when I was enrolled in 2002. However, in 2007, in grade three, uh, I had to leave because my father was completing his PhD in England. In 2011, I was back, although I only stayed for another year and a half or so before moving once again, this time to New Zealand. I regard this year and a half period that I spent at Lysen Pandora as one of the most influential periods in my life. I struggled a lot, but I also learned a lot. Uh, going back to Sri Lanka, going back to school in Sri Lanka, having spent the majority of the last five years just lounging around in England, uh, was what I imagined getting hit on the head by a cricket bat would feel like. Uh, it was a huge wake up call. Um, I was incredibly underprepared and I lacked the knowledge and the discipline that was needed for me to perform well academically. But the teachers at Life St. Thunder, they, they saw my potential and they supported me all the way through. Thanks to their encouragement uh, and their patience, I was able to really thrive both academically, but also in my extracurriculars, things like the arts, public speech, drama and debating. After that year and a half period, I moved to New Zealand and I attended Wellington College, which is one of the highest performing secondary schools in the country. The skills that I attained at Lyceum really opened up a lot of doors for me at Wellington College and I was able to flourish in many areas, uh, be it academics, the arts or even in leadership positions. All of this culminated in my final year at Wellington College when I was ranked one of the top performing academics and I was awarded a 40,000 New Zealand dollar scholarship to attend the University of Otago. And I was also appointed the head prefect of Wellington College during its 150th anniversary year. I am 22 years old now and looking back, it's quite strange realizing that I've reached a point in my life where the amount of time that I've spent in Sri Lanka is now less than the amount of time that I've spent outside of it. Even though my life spent there was short and my time in Lyceum was shorter still, the experiences I had and the values that I gained have been especially impactful in creating the foundation of the person that I am today. And for that, I'll always be indebted to my motherland and the incredible teachers and staff of my original alma mater, Light St. Parnaba. So if you are watching this video, take courage and take a lot of pride in the fact that you are in the hands of some of the world's greatest educators. Thank you for watching and best of luck for all your future endeavors.